Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to enable the weather widget in Windows 11 in the dev channel of the Insider program, build 22518. For those of you who don't know, in the latest dev channel build for Windows 11, 22518, Microsoft introduced a new entry point for the widgets section and the button that showcases the weather on the taskbar somewhere here in the left side. And if you were to change your taskbar behavior from the center to the left side, it would just show up as a weather widget icon. The thing is that if you upgrade it to this build, not everyone who is enrolled in the dev channel will receive it straight away because Microsoft is testing certain features with only a small portion of the users that are in the insider program. I'm not a big fan of this, but in this video, I'm going to show you how to enable that if you didn't receive it when you updated to the latest dev channel build. A quick disclaimer before doing anything if you are watching these videos you should know that everything that we do in these videos where we manually install packages where we change certain files in Windows all these changes come with some risks so you should know that I saw some comments regarding videos like this you can just wait for when it's officially released or something like that well the purpose of this video is how to install these before that if you don't have it so if you are not interested in certain modifications that come with certain risks please don't watch these videos so now let's begin you're gonna have to download Vive tool from the article down below in the description you're gonna have a link basically Vive tool is a C sharp library that you can use to make your own programs that interact with Windows 10s but you're gonna see that we can use it on Windows 11 as well feature mechanism so let's download this I'm gonna download the zip I'm gonna go into the location where that was downloaded now we're gonna have to extract this archive into the system 32 folder in Windows so I'm just gonna right click on this and then then extract all and select the folder where you want this to be extracted click on browse select this PC go down a bit local disk C Windows then go down to system 32 and extract it here in this folder and then click on extract you'll need to provide administrator permission to copy to this folder click on continue click on continue again and that will be extracted now what you need to do is to open up CMD open the search box type in there CMD right click on CMD and then click on one as administrator and on user account control click on yes in CMD you're gonna have to paste in four different commands that will be in the article down below the first one is this one paste it and run it the second one is this one you're gonna see that only this value will be changed throughout these commands so it's really really simple paste in and press enter to run all the commands and if you see successfully set feature configuration four times that means that everything was installed correctly now all we need to do is to restart our system right click on the start menu shut down or sign out and then click on restart and after the restart start we should have the weather widget on our taskbar of course if we are on the dev channel of the Windows Insider program and now after the restart you should see the new weather widget in the left side and when you hover over it the widget section should open up and you can use all your widgets as you can see you also have the temperature and the weather description if you want to change that to Celsius just go here and select Celsius and then click on save a few things that you need to know about this is that this is still a bit buggy when you start your system you're, you're gonna see the old icon for the widgets or for a few seconds and after that it will update to this new widget thing and also if you you don't see this new widget icon and you only see the old widget icon in the left side all you need to do is to open up the Microsoft Store and then go in the left side and click on library and here you're gonna have to search for all the updates available by clicking on get updates and then update all because you need to have the latest Windows web experience pack in order to see this new weather widget now let me show you what it looks like if we have our task for behavior set to left so I'm just gonna right click on the task bar and then click on task Taskbar settings, scroll down and then click on taskbar behaviors and taskbar alignment. I'm going to put it on left. And as you can see, we have a new icon, which is again the same one, but in a more compact way really like this centered I think and um, it being here maybe it's somehow harder to hover over it if you don't want as it was with the old news and interest widget that we had in Windows 10 so maybe this widget icon will be a bit more liked by the users I'm not sure about it but of course let me know down below in the comments what you think about this new weather widget I kind of like it to be honest so I think I'm gonna use it for a bit and see how it interferes with my daily workflow while I'm using Windows 11. That's going to be really, really interesting. So this was the video for today. Don't forget that all the information 
description all the links and all the commands used in this video will be in the article down below in the description don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one i was emmanuel from tech base until next time have a nice day